What's up guys, today we're reviewing the JMSS entrance exam math topic part 4, just like you guys requested. Today we're going to be um, separating them into three parts, easy, medium, hard questions. And we'll start off with the easy questions, these are the sample questions. And just a disclaimer, there are some of the, these are just some of the examples I collected for you to reference. And chances are that they won't come on the test, or they might. So please do not completely rely on these questions. But anyway, we've got these simple bod mass and um, like multiplication division questions, and even these simple third questions, which are going to be on the easy test, like I mean easy uh, easy part of the test. So these are like the first five questions. How the first five questions are normally going to be like. I'm telling you, the test gets way harder. Then this is just a very easy part of the uh, entrance exam. The first five or ten questions are normally like this. They'll just assess your bod mass and um, simple skills on division, subtraction, addition, and multiplication, and even some like easy topics on geometry and like area, surface area, all that. And also some like questions which will use some equations or formulas to find the answer. But nothing too hard here, these are just the questions that will be given to you. And they should be solved within 10 to 15 seconds. You shouldn't spend too much time on this. You should be able to solve most of them quite quickly and get through them fast. This is, if you can solve these quick enough, you'll get ahead of the te test and you can solve the harder questions with more time. So these questions should be done really quickly on your entrance exam test. So just be aware of that. And some of the questions might not take 10 to 15 seconds, but so it, it will still take like 20, 30 seconds. So quickly solve them and move on. It should only take a little bit of time for each question because you don't have much time to do them and you have to get through them quickly so you can solve the hard and medium type of questions. And these are some of the questions, how they look like. Most of them are geometry and yeah. Now we'll move on to sample medium questions. And these ones are from a, um, I'll just show you, they're mostly, some of them are going to be word problems, some of them are going to be like actual questions. And these will actually take some time to do, so 30 to 45 seconds to do, maybe even more than that. But it's not too hard, but it's not too easy. You'll actually have to know some knowledge, like um, the midpoint formula or the um the gradient formula for the linear equations you know and the, the average formula so you'd probably need to revise some of these some of the median questions are pretty hard for like most people as well so just stay aware of that and the uh, medium and hard questions are kind of um mixed around and most of them are search indices geometry or worded problems and even algebra and the most common ones are the thirds and um, the indices ones. You should be able to solve them pretty quickly. And yeah, we've got this third question, which you'll need to find like a way of solving really quick. And obviously the rationalizing questions. You should just be able to calculate this really quickly. And some linear questions. Yeah, and... So and the worded questions are pretty are pretty time consuming, especially because you have to read them and you have to use your knowledge to actually solve the question. So they will take like one minute or more. So just be careful of that. If you want, you can skip some of them, but it's entirely up to you. And most of the common questions are algebra, so you should be able to solve the simple algebra questions and the indices questions like this. And these should take like 20 seconds. The thirds ones can sometimes differentiate. These are pretty, pretty medium. The harder, the questions which are harder actually take a lot of time. So you have to manage your time quickly and solve the ones you can. And get back to the ones you can't. And like the rationalized questions are almost guaranteed to be on the test. But don't, don't rely on me because the tests like might change yeah you got your inequalities and especially these um 
like the geometry angles and all that it's definitely going to be on the test for me at least it was and now we'll move on to the sample hard questions these are a little tougher well actually way tougher this will need you to take a lot of time and you will actually need to know lots of formulas and how to solve them so you've got your to find the you also need to know like parabola and stuff and the geometry questions are pretty hard and challenging and they take 1 minute to 1 minute 30 seconds to solve so just be aware of that they can be a little time consuming and the parabola questions you'll need to know how to do it or you won't be able to solve much so I I rec highly recommend that you look at how to solve parabolas and especially the word questions they get longer and they're way harder to solve so maybe you would want to skip on that but it's your it's your decision to make you might be really good at them and you've got the hard word problems on geometry measurement and there will be one or two trigonometry questions so just be aware you should be able to solve them and simultaneous equations are a must so Linear equations simultaneous, you must know. And they're pretty hard, so please learn how to solve them. And you've got your um, word questions on probability. There'll be a few questions on probability, maybe one or two. So just be aware. And there'll be lots of puzzles, questions like this, these. You know, you'll have to, like, use, like, kind of, like, visualize them and try and solve them. And the parabola questions again. You'll actually know how to, you, you'll need to know like the equation of a parabola and the quadratics on how to solve them and how to plot parabolas and like the equation of the parabola. And you also have these complex equations. The equation gets really complex in the hard questions, so you must, you must know how to solve them really fast. This should take 45 seconds or more but you should solve them fast yeah mostly parabola questions are kind of tough and challenging yeah and you should know the discriminant and all that and these geometry questions get really hard like really hard they'll take two minutes or more to solve so you will probably need to skip there's like three really hard geometry questions like wish you all the best for your examination uh please do your best and Try and stay ahead of it. If you guys enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.